Hi everyone, this is Cognify Gman, your DIY study guide for the Gman. For today's video, I'm going to introduce the Gmat Official Guide 2021, which will be coming out in early June. I know it's a little early for an unpublished book, but hey, I wanted to let everyone know about the latest book. Amazon.com lists the price of OG 2021 as $47.95 American dollars, and they're accepting the pre-order which is slated to release on June 3rd, 2020. Quant review and verbal review will cost $20.95 American dollars each, and there is a bundle you can buy all three books for $77.85 American dollars, which is a 5% discount. If you don't know which book to buy, I would recommend to buy all three books because you need them anyway. You'll save about $8 with the bundle. The official guide to 2021 books available in Amazon are all paperback. If you want to buy an ebook, you can buy it at Wiley Efficient Learning website. I put relevant links in the description below so you can check out the ebook store and Amazon. The price of paperbacks and ebooks is the same, and even if you purchase a paperback, version, you can have an access to online study webpage or app. I strongly recommend studying with either ebook or website because that will simulate your test environment. If you ask me which is better, app or website, I would say website. It's better to utilize both the computer screen and the scratch pad. Now, let's have a look at the content of the new Officer Guide 2021. There are 998 questions in OG 2021, and an additional set of 174 questions are accessible via online question bank. So that's a total of 1,172 questions. There is a big change in the structure though. There used to be a diagonal touch in Chapter 3 of every GMAT Officer Guide. It's been there for about 15 years, and now it's gone from the official guide. Well, not quite. It moved to the online question bank. So what is the reason behind this change? The GMAC is now introducing a new 150 plus flash calls that is serve as a diagonal tick problem set. Many of my students complain that the diagonal test problems in the past are very difficult and they do not really serve the purpose of diagonal test. Because if you are not familiar with the test format and structure, it will defeat the purpose and waste problems. I think it's a good change and you can use them later once you are familiar with the GMAP format as extra problems. There is not much information about the new flash cards I've mentioned though. The GMAC is telling us that the flash cards can be found in the online question bank. And I quote their words, These flashcards have been designed to test users on the individual concepts that make up a GMAT question. The flashcards do not use retired GMAT questions. Rather, they contain simple problems and explanations of concepts. So you can see that the flashcards replace the purpose of the diagonal test. But while all officer guide questions are from the actual retired GMAT exam problems, the problems in the flashcards are a simplified version of GMAT concepts. I think it make an excellent introductory guide for the newcomers. So how do you access to the flashcard and the online question bank? There will be an access code on the inside front cover when you buy the official guide books. Go to gmat.wiley.com and enter the code and you can gain access to the flashcard, the online question bank, and all the same questions inside the official guide. Bookmark this webpage as you will need to frequently visit the site with a scratch pad. So, what's the difference between the OG 2021 and the previous 2020? There will be 181 more questions across all three OG 2021 books. The GMAT OG Verbal Review 2021 contains 347 questions, and Quant Review 2021 has 373 questions. Many of my students ask me whether they must buy the latest version of the Officer Guide. My answer is no. All GMAT Officer Guide books are consisted of actual questions from the retired GMAT exams, so it really doesn't matter what year or edition you get. Some of my students borrow past editions of the official guide from local libraries, and it's totally fine to study with the past editions. The only downside is that you cannot gain access to online webpage, but if you want to save money, you can borrow or use the past editions. Just make sure to utilize the scratch pad when you study. Don't write it directly on the books because you want to simulate the actual test environment as closely as possible. Okay, there was a sneak preview for the latest Officer Guide 2021, which will be released in early June. Don't forget to check the description below for all the useful links you can find about the OG 2021, and, and please subscribe and like the video if you found it useful. Good luck with studying!